Procrastination is likely the greatest killer of our dreams. It's not that we don't plan to do it. It's just that we don't plan to do it now. Tomorrow always seems to be the better time to get started on whatever it is that we need to do. Edgar, a guest, once wrote, he was going to be all that a mortal should be tomorrow. No one would be kinder or braver than he tomorrow. A friend who was troubled and weary he knew who would be glad of a lift and who needed it too. On him he would call to see what he could do tomorrow. Each morning he stacked up the letters he'd write tomorrow and thought of the folks he would thrill with delight tomorrow. It was too bad he was busy today and hadn't a minute to stop on his way. More time he would have to give others, he'd say, tomorrow. The greatest worker that man would have been tomorrow. The world would have known him had he only seen tomorrow. But the fact is he died and faded from view, and all that was left when living was through was the mountain of things he intended to do tomorrow. Life passes so quickly, and if we're not careful, many important things will pass us by as well. Often a message from God's word comes to us, and, and we know that there are things about our life that need to change, and yet some distraction gets in the way of us doing it. You know, in 2 Corinthians chapter 6 and verse 2, the Apostle Paul quotes the prophet Isaiah, who states that God will answer us, in an acceptable time and help us in the day of salvation. Then Paul adds to Isaiah's quote by saying, now is the acceptable time. Now is the day of salvation. You see, God is willing to help us, but only if we are willing to let him. Are you willing to let God transform your life today? Oh, it's easy to say, I'll wait for a better day or a more convenient time. The truth is that, that today is all we have. There's no promise of tomorrow, and there's no guarantee that we will have a better opportunity another day. Don't procrastinate. Don't let this day pass you by and miss the salvation that only God can give. With help with your spiritual walk with God and other messages from God's Word, Subscribe to our YouTube channel, like us on Facebook, and contact us at the Bessemer 24th Street Church of Christ, where Christ is King and faith works.